All right, let's get over to your first alert weather with the chief. Uh, we, we've got some chill in the air. Yeah, the amount of shoes that have been chewed at my house. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, that just happened recently, too. You can open All right. the fridge now. Don't ask me how. <laughs> Wow. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. That's a that's a show right that's there. A that's, a, that's some sort of TV show. All right. That is a problem. <laughs> the problem tomorrow for you is if you forget your coat because we have temperatures only warming into the mid 40s and small rain chances 10 to 20 percent. A lot of cloud cover returns and our northerly winds are holding on. Now on Saturday and Sunday, planning your weekend, not too bad. It's going to be cold to start, but the afternoon should be pretty nice. On Sunday, 60 degrees under partly cloudy skies. Wanted to show you that we're seeing our wind starting to gust up to near. 20 miles per hour. Here are the future cast wind gusts uh, as we go through the remainder of the night tonight into the early morning hours, possibly gusting up to near 25 miles per hour. And that's going to be off and on through the morning hours and then also into the afternoon. So that's going to add that chill to the air. Now, the first alert satellite and radar shows the cloud cover has increased. We're seeing this upper level, uh, level, si le <laughs> upper level system make its way from the northwest down to the southeast. And as that rotates its way on in, we're going to be seeing maybe some light rain developing in the early morning hours. Hours, drifting its way down to the south and east. There's the small potential that we could see maybe a couple of wet snowflakes mix their way on in. Better chances up near our Red River counties. Upper level low shifting its way to the northeast. So the cloud cover is here, and we might see some wrap around wrap around rain working its way back on into the northeast sides. Maybe seeing some of those wet snowflakes here or there, but I don't anticipate really any travel problems. All right, temperatures are in the mid 40s right now behind the front. All of us seeing the frontal boundary sliding its way through. We're in 48 in Keller to 52 at DFW to 50 in McKinney right now. So tomorrow morning, you're going to start out to the low 40s to the mid 30s in some spots, but feel even colder than that. Our temperatures are going to be warming up to 46 tomorrow, but when you factor in that wind, it feels like 35 to about 39 degrees with those winds out of the north northwest at 17. Monday to Tuesday, we'll alert you to the fact we have some rain on the way. That rain is going to be a little bit more widespread coverage on Tuesday morning for your morning commute and then shifts its way off to the east going into Tuesday, late morning hours into the afternoon. So the weekend, not bad. So right around for us Monday to Tuesday at a 80% chance overnight. Tuesday for Valentine's Day, 60% rain chances. Then we dry out nicely. Man, look at that Wednesday. 74 in sunny skies. Front moves through, cools us back down to 50 on Thursday.